And we start things off with some really positive breaking news ahead of the Super Bowl in the Superdome. Excitement is building this afternoon as a big game prepares to take over the Big Easy in just a mere 117 days. But today we are hearing some big news from organizers who are unveiling the details behind really a first of its kind Super Bowl parade that will not only showcase the best in football, but the best of the Crescent City has to offer as well. WDSC's Ariel Bromfield has more on that big announcement set to happen in just less than an hour, Ariel. Yes, and I can hear the excitement in your voice. It is an exciting day as we're getting some updates as New Orleans is preparing to host the Super Bowl for its 11th year. And like you said, uh, Randy, we are expecting a carnival style parade the day ahead of that big game, the Super Bowl. And we are actually told that Raising Cane CEO Todd Graves, he is actually going to be the grand marshal for the parade. He was chosen to showcase the homegrown talent who became one of the most successful and richest people from Louisiana. There will also be new custom built floats for the parade and cameos from signature floats, some of our favorites that we see every year during the carnival parades. The parade will also feature high school and college marching bands, and it's expected to roll on February 8th, which is the day before the Super Bowl. Also in about an hour, we are expecting to hear from the, from the NFL as well as the Super Bowl 59 host committee. They are going to be announcing some of those fan favorite events that we are expecting and looking forward to ahead of the big game. Of course, we will keep you updated as we know more about those events and their locations. But for now, from Mardi Gras World, I'm Ariel Brumfield, WDSU News. Ariel, looking